Anthony. You ain't got no f***ing back to f***ing. Yo, don't put your hands on me. Don't put your hands on me. Don't put your hands on me. You bugging the out. You bugging out, yo. Get the out of my face. You bugging. The f*** is wrong with him? She bugging the f*** out. So did y'all make up? me to go to the party at 1.13. Hi, I am Miss Kitsovane. How are you? As Black Ink's brand ambassador, I'm here to check things out tonight, make sure everything is up to our standards. Kitty? Hey, Kitty, how you doing? Hi, I'm Walter, how you doing? I'm, I'm, Kit I'm Kit Sylvain. I came here on behalf of C. Coming to check this, check this out. I'm here on behalf of Caesar. Who the f you think you are, bitch? You the messenger now? Hello, I'm Kit. I'm from 125th. The 125th. What the f does that mean? That means we are that. Oh, we are that. Why would you think that? No, I, I heard some stories about, you know, 130. You heard? Yo, Raggedy. What the f did you just say? Who gives you the balls to come in here and say that? What the f you mean we being raggedy? We didn't come up in two fifth like, oh, I heard you was. <laughs> we the original. I mean, you gotta be all that. Like, you know what they said? Messages get shot, bitch. I'm surprised. Surprised at what? Heard it was the raggedy. You feel some type of way? You said, do I feel some type of way? Because you're coming up in here talking about people are raggedy as hell. This is your first time meeting us. You sure you want to run your mouth like that? That's mad disrespectful. You don't say that to people. What's, what's your title, boo? What's your title? I'm the bitch that's gonna f you up. Question while you're here. I'm representing Caesar. I'm this rep is how you represent Caesar. I'm representing the shop at one time. <laughs> She's mad funny. It just pisses me the f off. How are you gonna walk into a place and judge people? You gotta know when to shut your mouth up. You don't gotta come y'all saying I'm just like, mm, I'm that's dang. just what we're saying. Did no, I but that's exactly your word, Hold so. Up. I mean, right everybody's kind of surrounding me right now, so because I feel a little bit like. Everybody's holding in when you're right. ready to yeah, push I'm you in your face. I'm like, we ain't we we not. Like, it's not my fault y'all shaped like a pack of Newports. That's not my fault. You need to blame genetics and your ugly ass parents. Yeah. Don't come in my face like that. I, what's up, boo? What's up, boo? What's up? What's up? What's up? Already? Tiffany, you've been here, what, two and a half days? I mean, I don't even want to hold down the black egg name and all that, but geez, Louise. Get that, what's what's that, what's that, what's that? Yo, what the f These are grown women over here acting like little children, scrapping over nothing. Disrespect the black ink. Stay where the f you are, bitch. Fucking get that bitch out. Fuck that ugly bitch out. C's is going to hear about this. Every time I see that bitch, it's going to be a problem. Yo, what the f is happening? And this is why I drink water. Y'all got to stop this. Like, this is whack. What we need to do is get some black ink crew tampons in this mother because it's about to get real messy with these bitches. Hey, hey, everybody, the f out. Hey, young man. What's up, bro? How are you? Man, Kitty. Hi. And look at number two. <laughs> look at y'all showing up all together. Talk about an entrance. Season Kitty over here looking like Hov and Beyonce before they got on the elevator. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like that all fake fancy, like a power couple and So what's up, Seas? Where you was coming from? My house. Oh, yeah. Oh. Where you coming from, number two? C's house? <laughs> yo, what are y'all trying to say, yo? I heard you single and ready to mingle. Hey, what are you talking about? That's what I heard, too. I heard that little birdie told me. What birdie told you, you that? what it is. He got this little mother cat nipping next to him, smelling like pee. 
Cats smell like pee to me. And they suck out baby's breath. She's the devil. And I need him to see a bad bitch sitting next to me. To my right. Whew. Sit right here, friend. Looking like an angel. Allison, you guys, you already know what Teddy Young Bay, Kevin, Allison, Kit, Allison, Caesar, you already know who Allison is because y'all went on a date the other day. Oops! Oh my God! Was that supposed to be a secret? Because I know y'all be seeing a lot of each other. If I finish this drink, I might be all over you. Finish your drink. Y'all was over at the house, I saw y'all in my binoculars. What? And you. You doing a lot of Oh! <laughs> Yo, what? What? Yo, what the f***, Sky? You f my game up. And you gonna get me killed tonight. My my apologies. Sorry, not sorry. What is up with this out? Did Sky have to announce it in front of everybody? Of course she did. Because she's a messy hoe. All I'm saying is there's a lot of going around the table. And from what I hear about a kick, there's a lot of <laughs> <laughs> What? I'm gonna be the best at it. I could tell. I knew she was gonna do that. Okay, Suzanne. Right, she's gonna be like, I'm gonna be the best. <laughs> well, like this, or, like she gonna get a scholarship. Okay, <laughs> announcement. As you all know, we're all under one umbrella. We are all a part of the Black King family. Who the f does Kid think she is? Like, or better yet, who the f does Caesar think she is? He ain't even let Duchess speak for him like this. So Caesar, do you have an announcement for us? It was good looking, Kit. No, nah, man, yeah, I needed yeah. that little announcement. You can sit down now. I brought all you motherfuckers together to let y'all know, as a family, as we go forward, I'm really starting to think about expanding. Expanding where? Are you trying to take over New York? Not New York, the country. I'm looking to open up another shop outside of New York. There's no better time than now with 113 back open with a bunch of talented artists. 125 is making a whole lot of motherfuckers money, I figured I got the blueprint to expand this black ink to the next level. It's time to become a mother mogul. Expansion is key right now. But for certain things that gotta be addressed. Yesterday I asked Kit to go over some branding unification lessons for y'all and y'all mother got twisted. Cause I heard Sky got up and left. She told us how to pour wine and answer phones, my I've been known how to answer the phone. How many people been coming through there? The point is, I want all my shops to feel the same. And that's Kid's job, to make one consistent brand. Let's get anywhere. We got to start getting some order in these motherfucking shops. I can't be everywhere. Y'all ain't motherfucking supposed to respect her like it's me. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Listen, what the is that supposed to be? I'm not supposed to respect her like a Jew. What no. are you trying to say no. right now? She's a like, no, no, stop. Shut up! Because he's looking at me. Yeah. What are you saying right now? That we have to respect her like it's you. No. And you just met her. No. Exactly. No. Shut up! You, you both are acting immature. Like, well, all due respect, bro, you and I got our own relationship. You my b big brother, and you my boss. And I respect you both ways. And we had this conversation. I said this was going to happen. What happened? I said, this bitch was going to get some of your little Jamaican and at the end of the day, like, you're a mini duchess. Get the out of here. Like, Absolutely I'm not a not. Right. She's not no little duchess. She's my employee. That's it. I'm done. I've had it. Evidently, this bitch kid got him by his nutsack. I only got him by the ear a little bit, and he might be deaf in that ear. So at the end of the day, I'm tired of being disrespected, because every time I'm talking to this you do not listen. Hey, Where you going? Don't go nowhere. Wait, Don't tell me what to do. Get your Where the is you going? I'm done. I don't respect this I don't deserve this I'm going to finish this shot. Don't leave. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, ma'am, ma'am, okay. ma'am. I'm done with Black Ink. If you feel like the brand ambassador deserves more respect than the people that have held you down, whatever. You oh. sees I quit. Hello. Yeah, what, what's up? Nothing. What you doing? Nothing in New York. I had a few tattoo clients I had to take care of. And um, guess who was coming by to talk to me? Please. Hell no. Kid. 
I have no clue. It's quite weird. I'm really confused on why Kit wants to talk to me. We haven't spoken in God knows how long. We have absolutely nothing in common to speak about except for the fact that you're my ex. You're not my friend, and he's not my lover. So we don't have anything to talk about. If she want to come and act like she ain't got no sense, beat her ass. Bye. 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 What's up? Hey. How, how you are doing? You? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. What's wrong? Oh, this is nice. Thank you. I want to talk to Duchess because I want to know why she talking calling me a thought pocket, especially since I'm only dating one man. She's the one that's been hoeing here, 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 just hoeing everywhere. But rather than sink down to her sorry ass level, I'm just going to go handle this like a grown woman. What's been up? Nothing working. How you been? I've been OK. I haven't seen you in a while. Why would you see me if you're going to be my ex fiance? That doesn't make sense. If you're trying to be my friend, that wouldn't make sense. I wouldn't say friends, especially since you've been running your mouth about me to people. I'm just saying, you know, I heard you felt some type of way. Oh, if you didn't hear it from my mouth, you didn't hear anything, because I can tell you what I feel. I have your number still. Oh, you go ahead. How do you feel? You came to me. If I had anything to say to you, I would have called you. I didn't have anything to say. Well, then let me put it like this. If I would call and check up on you, what would you ask me? I don't have a reason to check up on you. I ain't your ex. You my ex, sweetheart. You can go. You got my, you got my ex, sweetheart. You, you doing what you want to do. Duchess is up here being a little frigid bitch, but she clearly doesn't have the balls to say what she was saying behind my back in my face because she's pussy. You're showing me that you're not a friend. You're showing me the type of lady you are. And who am I? Oh, please let me know. You're oh, just what? another bitch, and I want you to know that. And I want you to oh, know well, that. I'm another it, bitch. It, it, you just another bitch. You might, might want to watch your mouth. You worry about the bitches that he got around you that he's he Don't worry about me. Um, I ain't got time for your bull You gonna get the hell up out of here. Let me escort you out, sweetheart. No, I thought I'm you was coming here no. for a different reason, but you're not. For, so you for can, what? For what you reason? You can exit, sweetheart. I'll leave when I'm ready to leave. You're gonna leave. Oh, you don't want to make your exit? Well, I'll gladly assist you. What's going to happen if I don't? Hold up. This is what's going to happen. Get the out. Get the out. Bitch, you got me up. Bitch, you got me up. Bitch, I will hell you in this bitch. I know this bitch didn't try to say no happen. No Get off of me. No. I'm going to kill that bitch. No. How you going to pepper spray a bitch and run? No, you're awesome. Now I got to you up. Bye, bitch. Bitch, I'm going to you up. What well, you doing come... from a distance? <laughs> bitch, why are you hiding behind the door? Come out and fight. <laughs> come on, queen. Queen, come out, queen. Goodbye. You got to bring peppers. Goodbye, sweetheart. You ain't oh, I don't fight. Ain't I don't This is exactly why I maced this girl. Because I'm not about to fight your crazy dumb ass. You work for Caesar as a front desk receptionist. His sweetheart, I am a boss. You talking all that and I'm going to keep talking it. But you ain't trying to see me with them hands. Until you come for me, bitch, you ain't at another receptionist, ho. You just a receptionist. Weak ass receptionist right. at that. Yeah, you a weak ass bitch, pussy. You came here, sweetheart. Yeah, weak ass. Oh, that bitch is catching the whole fade when I see her. There is never gonna be a time where we can be in the same room and she not gonna catch these hands. You can't want every time. She dumb, yeah. Crash dummy. She's a dead bitch. so-called friends did to help stop it. Everybody faking like they my friend and What the Ain't nobody got nothing to say. The way everyone has been treating me since this ridiculous blog post about me and Ryan has me questioning who my friends really are. I 
I want to know who the backstabbing bitch is that tried to tell Caesar that this rumor was true. All I got to say is gotta be real about that. Your sex life is your sex life. But it's inflicting, you already know. You and Tati is not as close as y'all used to be. You and Kay is not as close as you used to be. And me and you is growing apart. But I feel like you're dragging everybody into your lies right now. What? what? So what am I lying about? I just want everything to come clean because everybody will feel so much better. This is dragging. Like, what does it matter if you lying? Because I did it. Oh my God. I did it. Yes, Hold you up. did. Is anybody there yes, with you me? Did. and friendships are at stake. Oh, Jesus. Hi, Kitty. Hi. Oof. Lord, it's cold. It's time for all this drama with kids to end. Like, I don't like this negative energy around, so I'm just gonna be straight up with her. Thanks for coming. Of course, sweetie. Let's get right to it. Mm-hmm. What's all this tension between, like, Donna, Tati, and you? I mean, I have nothing to say to them. I told Tati I never wanted to speak to you again, and I meant it. OK, what about Donna? Donna, initially, I told Donna I would be open to having a conversation. But then Donna got on social media and kept badgering me, just talking nonsense. You know what? I'm getting tired of answering all of these questions. I mean, why is everybody acting like I did something to them? I mean, it's been Donna that's been blasting me all over social media. I'm not supposed to defend myself? She told me she was going to beat me up when she saw me and just, like, all this other stuff. So I'm like, okay. Well, if you say that, you gotta make good. Ah, oh, Kitty doesn't want to own up to anything she did. Like, she did a lot of wrong to all of us. Like, girl, please own up to your and say sorry. 
Can you, you can't be here and tell me that you never talk about everybody to everybody. And that you know, get to each other. No, I, I can't talk about no, everybody. I can tell you who I talk about because I talk it in your face. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. I mean, if you're gonna lie again, I'm like, come on now. I mean, what am oh I Oh my lying? God. What am I lying about? Come on, like, I gotta go. Because, bitch, you're so no. fake. Okay. Just say you're no. sorry. Why can't people ever admit that they did something wrong and that they're sorry? That's it. No, no, I know. I know you're fucking bitch. You never pull the f***ing No, you don't fucking bitch. You got your f***ing guy. Oh, oh, bitch. Yo, I still didn't do nothing. That's it. Period. That's it, bitch. Go f***. All right. When I see her, I swore everything I love. I'm beating that ass. Maiden lost her mother mind. That's all I know about that. Now we got a problem. Okay, so. Kitty is about to attempt a 12 pound burger with over 18,000 calories. Oh, no. Oh, herself. My mother taught me never to turn away food, but this is so many calories for my Southern Belle sensibility to handle, OK? Ready, set, go! Oh, man. Just pick the whole thing up and bite it. Try to make a little more time. There you go. Get it, girl. Oh, yeah. You ain't get no burger. This burger is bigger than my whole body. One, two. Oh. Wow. Another baby. Wow. Are you really gonna eat that? Yeah. By yourself? Yo, listen, you worry about that one. That is crazy. Jeez Louise. Yo, I'm killing this burger challenge. You gotta eat it like a savage. No. I love America. Mommy, I tried. I believe we have a winner. Um, when are we gonna start looking at places to start opening up our shop? I don't understand why we already said that we would not talk about it at this time. We would wait. I told this girl that today is supposed to be about celebrating my mother and experience in Memphis. But obviously, uh, she doesn't get it because she's still bringing it up after I told her to stop talking about it. I mean, she liked that little net at the cookout just bugging the out of me. I just want to know when can we fit it into the schedule. Do you understand what you're actually here for? But I'm, I'm still here to work, so. No, yeah, no, no, you're you here to do really. what I'm saying to do. You are here no, to. Not really. I thought you're here to. Not that okay, either. well, if you ain't here to help me celebrate my mom, then you can get the f up out. Because you're getting the f on my nerves. That's, I, I didn't say that. That's, that all, that's, all, my that's, right that's all my mother brain right here. That's all my mother brain. Before that spirit come over me and put my hands on you, I'm going to get up and I'm going to go step outside. Right. Okay. Not for nothing. Like, I understand that you're trying to, like, put your ideas and, like, you just gotta understand that there's a time and a place. I think you need to go sit outside with Kitty. Well, you are after the fact type to do anyway. All right. Check your girl. It's all right. Don't let her get to you. Kit Kat. You all right? Mm -hmm. London is my assistant, and I get that she's trying to make a good impression on the Black Ink brand, but I specifically specifically said that everyone respect the itinerary that I've laid out to celebrate my mom. It's about you know, celebrating my mother's life. And as long as everybody can respect that, I'm good. Hi, Blackie. Hi. Hello. I'm looking for Caesar. That's me. Hi, I'm Signature. How you doing, Signature? Oh, so you trying I to get tatted? No, actually, I'm not. Well, I'm actually looking to help with brand marketing. Oh. That would be me, sweetheart. Hi, what's Hi. your name? I'm Signature. Kitty, how are you doing? Hi. Well, I'm the brand ambassador, so, oh. like, any marketing or anything, like, 
That would be... Well, I'm gonna show him first, and then I'll come to you, okay? Hmm. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Kid, you got some competition. This finna be good, all I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't think I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look. <laughs> I'm gonna look all right. Because clearly the way to pitch yourself as a brand representative is to come dressed in a Canadian tuxedo. Girl, get out of here. Okay, let's cut to the chase. How many shops you got? Right now, I got four. And as a boss, you want to level up, correct? Mm. People need to know about you guys, and that's why you sell merchandise. I see your shirts and stuff over there, but we want to have places like Amazon selling your stuff. We have basketball players, rappers. We have students, so that you can get every dollar. GED. <laughs> This is not funny, but come on! This girl's marketing pitch is a joke. I just want to level you up to the next level. Please don't really have time for all that. You should be talking to me. I think you have a lot of time for me. But you'll have time for me? I mean, your pretty face is getting the time you get in there. Do Miss Skeeto know about that? <laughs> Excuse me. First of all, it's Miss Kitty. Miss Kitty? That means pussy. What the? Just like you trying to sell the seeds right now. Don't nobody want that little rancid pussy that you over here trying to pitch. Listen, I told you my name was Signature, right? Right. You can't do nothing without a signature. Oh, God, she didn't press the <laughs> Look, I'm not hiring right now, and I know Kitty's a little offended. I'm just teasing her by hearing this girl out. Look, I got something for you. Get your phone. Take my number. Give me a call. Are you ready to take Black Kings to the next level, right? <laughs> this is some bull <laughs> This girl comes in disrespecting me and sees it's just letting this bitch just slide through. See, you're trying to be funny. You do that shit all the time. It's OK, I'm going to let you have it. We'll talk later. Go ahead, Rhythm Nation. <laughs> <laughs> delivering this unsavory news that Caesar and Teddy have tasked me with. These hoes are gonna go crazy on me, and I'm just gonna build these bitches up and just break them down. All right, so I just wanted to review a few things. Y'all know that we are here for water. No other energy will be tolerated but funny, positive <laughs> stuff. And with that being said, Caesar and Teddy are in the car. They want me to tell Tati and Kid to leave and get a hotel. Oh, what? God. They do not want you guys here. Oh. I'm tired. Whoa. Hold the f up. So first, Teddy's gonna try and tell me who I can and cannot f And now he's gonna try and tell me where I can put my head down? Get the f out of here. Why are they not here talking? No, um, because I'm head of HR. They making it about them right now. Right, and this it's ain't about them. Why I'm in here right now. OK, I'm well, tell I'm them even. that I ain't going there. And if they got a problem, they can talk to their motherfuckers selves about it. <laughs> Unbelievable. Who does Caesar think he is? I mean, this weekend isn't even about him or Black Ink. This trip is about Walt. And if Walt tells me that he wants me to leave, then that's one thing. But I'm not gonna let C's just think he gonna bulldoze me over over this damn bullshit ass rumor about me sleeping with Ryan's nine bag. Are you leaving? Are you off? What are you about to do? I'm about to go have a conversation. You, what's happening? I don't know. What the is going on over there? Well, that looks like... spicy. Oh, God. I'm not missing something here. What's Hi, up, Kitty? Caesar. How are you? Oh, my. You chilling? Um, what's this about? You want us to leave? I mean, I'll be honest. If y'all gonna be confrontational like that, y'all can get the f out. You don't think asking us to leave is confrontational? That's not nah, the way y'all coming down here is like. Well, we just trying to clarify because we here for Walter. We not trying to make it about y'all. The Why problem is this tension. I just came out here to say, I mean, I'm not going anywhere. Period. 
I'll be honest with y'all, y'all gonna have to calm yourself down and remember, like, this ain't y'all, all right? This is my, I got that, I can say whatever I want. All this y'all, if I really want y'all to leave, y'all will leave. Now y'all could dismiss yourself. The f y'all think this is? I'm to talking like to y'all, the ones that's about to walk back in the house and y'all can stay, because I said y'all can stay. Whatever, you disrespectful as Y'all disrespectful. You always, you've been disrespecting you me for four years. You work like for that. me. You work for me. What are you going to do? What is what? Listen to what? You want to stop what? No, what you want to happen? You ain't got no, no sense. You ain't got no sense. You ain't got no sense. I've never, I've never done anything to you. Don't put your hands on me. Don't put your hands on me. Don't put your hands on me. You bugging the out. You bugging out, yo. Get the out of my come face, on, you bugging. The f are we in? She bugging the f out. So did y'all make up? Yeah. What? What? Oh. Yeah. He a mediocre ass tattooing oh. He's locked up. Oh. What you doing? Got nothing. What are you looking down on your phone for? Like, have fun. I'm tired. I've been going since sunrise in Juve, so I'm running out of steam at this point. Did you see Crystal's new show? What? No, like, cause you know, I heard Crystal is talking mad about you. You told me that Crystal has been talking so much about you, and I'm still in shock about what she's been saying. Let me just give it to y'all wrong. She told me that she a slut and she's trying to sleep her way to the top. What I heard is really harsh. I don't know how to break that down to her. I'm gonna have to find the right words to soften the blow. She thinks you're a slut, right? And then she thinks that you're the way up to the top or you're trying to. Wow. And she thinks that are trying to force your way into Caesar's life, and she wants you out of his life. She called you a tramp assistant? That's what she called me, a tramp assistant? First of all, who was first of all? Like, Caesar's baby mama. And that's all she'll ever be, and that's probably why she mad. <laughs> you just mad because your baby father want me. I don't have time for any of this. I feel like... She got a thing for C's again, and now she feels like she can get him back or something. I don't know. But she's always had a thing for C's, and I don't think it ever left. I thought we were cold pool. So, I don't know. Maybe there's more to the story. You know, I feel like you should talk to her. For what? For what? If she got all this to say about me, and she feels so strongly about me, about a man that then said on numerous occasions that he don't want to, which has nothing to do with me, by the way. Like, that's her own insecurity, and she got to work out for herself. She don't got to say to me. I've worked damn hard for everything that I have. And for Crystal just to dismiss that and call me some type of tramp assistant shows me what kind of person she really is. I don't give a about that woman. I'm not trying to get sued for rearranging somebody's new job. Okay. I don't got time for this. I see Kitty soaking in a corner, and she's been acting like that ever since I made my appearance. I feel like she's bothered from my presence. So I think it's time that I find out what is her real deal and tell her how I really feel about how she's trying to sneak into Caesar's life and in our family. Why are you doing here by yourself? What's going on? Oh, nothing. Are you kidding me? I'm not talking to this bitch after all she been talking about me. I'm gonna clear some up with you. I gotta go to the bathroom. You go to the bathroom? Okay. But the bathroom is right there. She pressed or something? What's wrong with her? I'm not getting sucked into this little petty bull. I mean, I have nothing to prove to Crystal. No matter what happens, she still has a Pomeranian face. Looking like Smokey's sister. Ain't that right? No, you're way cuter. You're way cuter. So I see why she's mad. You walking away? Looks like Kitty Crystal. I wasn't done speaking. Uh, yo! This is great. Leaving? You want to talk to your baby? Go ahead. Yo, this is crazy. Kitty can't even have a adult conversation with me, woman to woman. Like, what's wrong with her? What are you following her for? Baby Leave girl, girl what's her going on? Like, why? She must have heard that I thought she was a tramp ass assistant. 
She got the stance. Look at the back leg. It's ready to kick off. Yo! Where are you going? I'm going to talk my but I'm going to say it to your face. Do what you want to do, but leave me the alone. Is she serious right now? Like, Crystal, darling, you cannot hide that ugly spirit behind a new face. I mean, I'm done being nice. So if we talk now, I guarantee she's going to have to get jaw surgery again. You're running like some scared little girl. That oh, I'm not going to say it again. Hey, Donna. Kitty, girl, where are you? I called the car. I'm walking to it now. Maybe you should just come back and, and have a conversation. Oh, she hung up. I don't know what these two are fighting about, but chasing Kitty when she doesn't want to be chased is not a good idea. I hope Crystal took a warranty out on that new job. Where'd she go? She's in the car? Kitty, I know you in there. Hey, y'all. It's your boy, Caesar, Black Ink CEO. And if you don't know me, the reason why is you ain't subscribed to VH1 YouTube channel. At the end of the day, you already know. That's the number one channel on YouTube. And if you don't got it, I guess you just watch the number two.